driving so slow, but BK is from Texas. Me, I'm out there, bed stop. Home of that boy. Hello, Editing Kaylee here. I forgot to film an intro. So, hola, bienvenidos a mi canal. Yo soy Kaylee, and welcome to the skate vid. Please enjoy this one minute montage. If you've seen it already, um, enjoy the new music. You know I bleed blue, but I ain't a crypto. But I got a gang of niggas walking with my click though. Welcome to the melting pot, corners where we selling rock. Africa been by the shit, home of the hip hop. Yellow cap, gypsy cap, dollar cap, holla back. For foreigners, it ain't fair, they act like they forgot how to act. Eight million stories out there in the naked. City is a pity, half of y'all won't make it. Me, I got a plug, special when I got it made. And she's paying LeBron, I'm paying the Wayne Way. Three dice, CeeLo, three card Molly. Labor Day parade, rest in peace, Bob Molly. You were liberty, long live the world yeah. trade, long live the king, yo. I'm from the empire. New York, I'm I actually used to work at this Whataburger that I went to, and so I get severe anxiety going back. I ordered the spicy chicken sandwich, plain and dry, on Texas toast. But the front counter lady put plain well done. <gasps> Why is there a yellow wrap? They ask you how you are and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. So they messed up my order. I remember I said the thing about the anxiety. Well, I couldn't bring myself to go back inside and face the front counter lady. So I paid for it. I didn't explain it very well here, but so instead of saying that they messed up my order and asking for a free remake, I just ordered like normal, and I paid for it, so. This one is plain and dry. Oh, this is what it looks like, in case you're curious. It's beautiful, isn't it? And then I got it on toast. Yummy! Alright guys, you know the drill, starting off with some ollies, trying to warm up, and then I started trying to do 180s, like, I don't even know, I was not warmed up enough to start 180s, um, and, yeah, I don't know, I, every time I've landed a 180, like, I've always practiced, like, moving my shoulders and staying on my toes, and it just wasn't happening, I don't know, also, I felt really full for meeting Whataburger, so... There's that. By the end of this session, I drank a full two Monster Hydros. Very yummy. Also, uh, by these clips, I know it may look like I kind of just like give up after a couple times, but I do edit quite a lot of footage and I just kind of keep the stuff I think is entertaining or... Um, essential to show as part of like progress you know here i'm starting to work on my strawberry milkshake i kind of decided today was not a jumping kind of day so like no ollies and 180s and such i just kind of wanted to do minimal jumping oh yeah i bought this wax it's shaped like the curb isn't that so cute look there's a little curb and then there's the big curb all right, now it's board slide time. I accidentally broke my wax, so I just threw the little piece there on the floor. And I actually, like, first try, almost got it, but my weight was too far back. 
my approach to board slides is very much like easing into it so i kind of just go through the motions very slowly i mean that was good that was pretty good right there but i kind of just usually go through the motions pretty slow like this that way i can develop muscle memory and um master like the weight distribution of leaning forward and then eventually i want to work my way to go fast so that way it just glides along you know then I started getting somewhere and I started getting really excited see I'm running back that's how you know when I'm super excited I run back get some hydro I'm like it's go time we're not playing games anymore and you can also tell by my noises my noises get like progressively louder and then this happened I started getting unsolicited advice and I understand there's good intentions. They're just trying to help me out. I'm just the frustration of me having to take out my AirPods is at a 10. And all the clips following the unsolicited advice are me just trying to do what he told me to do, but it just wasn't working out for me and it I don't know, I guess it just kind of got me out of the mood. I'm gonna walk to the mall to clear my head. Not with the intention of buying anything, but to clear my head. Because I like clothes. I don't know. So yeah, impromptu mall trip. I was really trying not to buy anything, but I did end up getting this zip up because I felt like I completed the outfit. Excuse me, and um, they had a lot of cute stuff. I ended up getting this one t-shirt at PacSun that had like a skater ollieing over a cop car. And I thought it was so suiting because one, I just came from a skate session. And two, I feel like most skaters have had run-ins with the cops. My friends and I um, are no exception. We've gotten in trouble for trespassing on school property and skating. And uh some stuff at the park where the cops like pull in all dramatic and you know make a whole scene it's just typical skater stuff you know so i just had to get this shirt that like paid homage to the i guess culture i also um tried on this crop top my bonsai was hanging out definitely do not have my high school body where i used to wear tiny crop tops also, I tried on the brandy sweatpants, and I don't get it. I don't... Update part two. So I did some research on the shirt I got at PacSun. The brand is actually Brandy Melville's mail line. I didn't even know they had a mail line, but they do. And it consists of 35 millimeter photos and skateboarding graphics. Brandy Melville quality with skateboarding graphics. I don't know what more I could ask for. Super stoked about that. 